never have I been asked, are you human or not human, right? So do you feel you've been deceptive at all? I really feel like there have been moments of some level of creative nonfiction where I, in order to I guess, survive or protect people that I love, I have um, kind of had to explain or justify some of the timeline and logistics of my life in a way that made sense to others. So I've tried to find words that have been able to communicate my reality to people that, are, that, that I'm talking to, um, understanding what their perceptions might be. But just as a human being, you know when someone asks you, you know exactly what they're asking you. And for you to say yes, is that an honest answer, knowing what their question is? I actually don't get asked very often. Um, up to this point, I haven't had a DNA test. But there's been no biological proof that Larry and Ruthann are my biological parents. I right. doubt whether those Ruthann and Larry who say they are your parents. You doubt whether they're your parents? I have. I, I don't. I, I'm just saying I can't prove that. Why would you doubt something so fundamental? I'm not just say, saying that that I can't prove they're not, but I don't know that I can actually prove they are. I mean, the birth certificate is issued a month and a half after I'm born. Um, it certainly, um, there are no medical witnesses to my birth. <laughs> Who do you think your parents might be? Well, I, I, I don't know. You know, like I said, I, I just don't feel like I can necessarily say now with the full scrutiny of, can you prove that you are Larry's aunt's biological child that actually has never been proven. I think that's where people are having trouble with you, Rachel. I think they feel that you have been, for whatever reason, and perhaps wonderful reasons, mm -hmm. acting like you're something that you are not. Right. So, you know, what's the word for it? You know, I mean, I, the closest thing that I can come to is there's been a, a kind of transition. Um, and this has been talked about in terms of appearance and everything that that has taken place um, somewhat in waves and, and yet progressively. Yeah, let me ask you about that because you look very different than you look right now. Have you changed your physical appearance? <laughs> um, yeah, well, definitely. I've I've experimented with my hair, skin color, and eye shape, right? I mean, those are the three identifiers physically. I don't know that that was necessarily like a conscious, I am going to now physically transform myself at this juncture. It, it kind of was more something that just like happens. Open your mind. 